I'm going to show you guys how to use the sounds from your native instruments expansions inside of any DAW of your choice. First things first, you need to go ahead and open up your native access, go to your preferences, go to file management and see where your files will be located. You want to see where the content location is, not the application location or the download location, because that doesn't really matter. So from there, what you want to do is go to that location. So I'm going to pull mine up. OK, so right now I'm in my native instruments folder. And what you want to do from this point is go to your expansion. For example, Burl Chops is one of the latest expansions. You click on it, go to samples, one shots. Here they are. Here's some wave files. Let's play it. This is where all of your stuff is. So if you are using Logic, you can set this location inside of Logic as a favorite, which is what I did. I have my native instruments folder bookmarked so that way when I'm looking to add files, I just go to my native instruments folder. Bam, all the expansions are there. I can go through, listen to all of these kicks and drag them, do whatever I want to do with them. Same thing goes for FL Studio. You can go through, drag and drop, drop the folder in there. Or if you want to go through the process of setting it up in their uh, file structure, I haven't done that in years, but if you want to do that, you can go ahead and do that so that way when it opens up FL Studio, this would be there. I think dragging and dropping works as well. You just take this folder, drag and drop it. So that is quickly how you find your sounds from your expansions and use them other DAWs. Um, those are the ones that I use. I'm pretty sure it'll be similar with other DAWs such as Serato Studio, things of that nature. So if you guys have any questions on that, let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys for tuning in. If you need help using machine, I have my video course up on teachable.com and it's entitled How I Use Machine. I cover everything from how I start a beat to finishing the beat. The link is in the description below. So if you need help with machine, go check that out. Hopefully you enjoyed the video.